Hello. Today, we'll be showing you how to replace the motherboard in a Lenovo X131e Chromebook. First, you will need a few tools. An anti-static mat is recommended to prevent electrostatic discharge, which can damage electronic parts. A small magnetic tip Phillips head screwdriver will be necessary for this replacement. You will need thermal paste during this replacement. A spudger will also come in handy during this replacement. You can use either plastic or metal, whichever you prefer. If you have tweezers, you may also want to have them handy, as they might be useful when dealing with small parts. The first step will be to remove the battery. Next, you will remove the two bottom cover screws. Now, you will loosen the three screws holding the bottom plate cover on and then remove the bottom plate cover. Next, you will remove the two memory sticks. Now, you will remove the tape from the wires on the SD card and disconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables from the Wi-Fi card. Next, you will remove the SD card screw and then remove the SD card. Now, you will remove the Wi-Fi card screw and then remove the Wi-Fi card. Next, you will remove the four M2x8 screws. Now, you will remove the M2x5 hard drive case screw. Now, you will use your spudger to pry up the keyboard and then lift it and tilt it toward you. Next, you will disconnect the two keyboard cables and remove the keyboard. Now, you will remove the three M 2x5 screws from under the keyboard. Next, you will disconnect the microphone cable. Now, you will disconnect the touchpad cable. Next, you will use your spudger to pry up and remove the palm rest assembly.
Now, you will disconnect the speaker cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the USB cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the power button cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the LCD cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the camera cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the two motherboard screws. Now, you will lift the motherboard, disconnect the power cable, and remove the motherboard. Next, you will loosen the four heat sink screws. Now, you will disconnect the fan cable from the motherboard. Now, you will remove the heat sink and fan from the motherboard. The first step in the installation of your replacement motherboard will be to apply thermal paste to the CPU on the motherboard. Now, you will set the heat sink and fan into place on the motherboard and tighten the four heat sink screws. Next, you will reconnect the fan cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the power cable to the motherboard and set the motherboard into place. Next, you will replace the two motherboard screws. Now, you will reconnect the LCD cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the power button cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the camera cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the USB cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the speaker cable to the motherboard. Next, you will snap the palm rest assembly back into place. Now, you will reconnect the microphone cable. Now, you will reconnect the touchpad cable. Next, you will replace the three M 2x5 screws under the keyboard.
Now, you will reconnect the two keyboard cables and snap the keyboard into place. Next, you will replace the M2x5 hard drive case screw. Now, you will replace the four M2x8 screws. Now, you will replace the Wi-Fi card and the Wi-Fi card screw. Next, you will replace the SD card and the SD card screw. Now, you will reconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables to the Wi-Fi card. Next, you will tape down the two wires on the SD card. Now, you will replace the two memory sticks. Next, you will replace the bottom plate cover and tighten the three bottom plate cover screws. Now, you will replace the two bottom cover screws. The final step will be to replace the battery. You have now successfully replaced the motherboard in your Lenovo Chromebook. Good job.